What up, folks? I'm Ultrazilla, and today I have a review of the Bandai Popinika Godzilla Final Wars Go Tango. All right, my Zillions, hope you're staying safe today. We got a nice little piece here that's, oh, I don't know. I don't know how old this is. Uh, Hats to be, I don't know, 2004, 5, 6? Sometime, somewhere in there. It could be a little bit later than that. But uh, it's new to me, new-ish at least. I got this in the last six months or so. I bought it off of eBay, maybe eight months, I don't know. Uh, time is uh, a vacuum uh, <laughs> right now, so I have no idea when I got it. But it was it within the last year for sure. Again, I picked it up on eBay. It was still brand new, which was excellent. I've always wanted this. I flirted with getting it multiple times, never did. Uh, but then it came up and I was like, yep, that's that's a good price for me. And I picked it up. So without any further ado, let's get into this. So this piece just comes with a nice stand. You got to put the little two pieces in there, the little stands. Uh, it's nice. It's just done in black, some texture to it. But, you know, nothing crazy here going on. But it does look good with the Gotengo on it. So that's how you would do that. Nice and simple. It's fine. It, it makes for a nice little display piece. And honestly, that's really just what this is. A, a nice little display piece. There's nothing crazy going on here. As far as colors go, you got black. You got this red across here, which doesn't even look that neat uh to tell you the truth um totally inconsistent on both sides it's just sprayed very strange I, I don't know what's up with that but it's not so good looking and then you got this uh silver up here for the drill which does rotate so you get a little bit of articulation there if you want for rotation these things do move slightly right here these rudders uh on this side i one of these two things got busted a little bit i think it's this one moved it too much and it yeah it was this one i'm not even gonna try to move this one um so do be careful you know if you've never got this and you see this video and you're like oh i need to get that so yeah be careful with those not so uh great uh, otherwise, there's no articulation on this. And that's all the colors. The rest of it is this kind of like warm gray, like dark warm gray. And, you know, it does have some pearlescence to it as you look into it, um, which is cool. But the sculpt is very nice on this. I do like it a lot. Um, it's, it's a nice piece. For sure. You know, oh, oh man, this thing did fall off on me. So I guess moving it around a little bit too much caused that. Oh, can it go back on? Yeah. <laughs> it might fall off again. Uh, it is busted. But the sculpt is very nice. You see a lot of detail in this. The drill looks cool. Uh, and by the way, I'm looking at, now that I'm looking at it, I'm guessing there's a little bit more red on this side because this is the side they'd want you to display it on because here you have like some screw holes on this side. So I guess they've figured, forget the paint on that. Um, but yeah, the bridge looks pretty good. Not bad. This bottom, ooh, bottom piece looks pretty good where the engine is. Engine? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what I'm saying. Um, but whatever. The thrusters and stuff. Uh, it looks good. It's it's a very nice looking piece. These are very soft plastic. Back here. They don't really move, but they're very soft plastic. Uh, the rest of the material. The bottom is all plastic. But the top here, this whole top piece. I don't think this piece, maybe. But this here is die cast. And now, for the longest time, uh, so many folks have called this a Chogokin piece. Uh, maybe because of that die cast. And I always got confused because every time I looked up Chogokin, you know, uh, Gotengo, it would come up, but like, it, it definitely it wasn't a Chogokin um, branding. So it took me a while to figure out that it was in the Popineka 
uh, Popinica, Popinica, I think it's Popinica line, uh, which, you know, Popey, uh, anywho, uh, but it goes way back, uh, that line, and, you know, it's all about, like, vehicles, I believe mostly, with the latest one being the, the vehicle from Cowboy Bebop, which I've flirted with getting a couple times, it is a, a bit pricey, and I don't know the exact size, so if it, I can't remember, seeing, I think it's a bigger than this, this is, you know, a little small, uh, but it works. I mean, for you folks that would want this for like a six inch figure scale, I feel like this definitely, definitely works. And you'll see that uh, comparatively uh, in my size comparisons right after I am done talking here. Uh, but, oh, you know what? I think this pot, top piece is die cast actually. Now that I'm really feeling it. Yeah, this is die cast and this part is die cast. So up here, the bridge, and this part is die cast. Everything else below it, that piece fell off again. I'll have to re-glue it. So yeah, I don't really get anything out of that one, but what are you gonna do? Well, I don't wanna break other ones. Um, Yeah, it's a nice looking piece. It is. It's simple, but it is very, very nice. You know, screw holes, breakage, and you know, a little less paint on this side, uh, notwithstanding. It's a cool representation of the Gotengo, which I really, really loved. For your size comparisons, here is the Gotengo with a bunch of figures you might have in your collection, including Anguirus from Final Wars. He's the only Final Wars figure I was able to scrounge up right now. But there you go. I think, uh, I think that scale is pretty decent. I like it. It's cool. It's not perfect. But I'm glad I finally got this. You know, like, it's been a piece that I've wanted for quite a while. And uh, I was able to snag it on eBay for a decent price. And it's good enough, you know. As far as details, it's there. The paint is a little weird. And, you know, it's not that much. But the Gotenga was kind of... You know, it didn't have a lot of color going into it. So, um, that's fine as far as I'm concerned. Definitely does the trick for me at least. Um, and that's it, you know, that's my review. I hope you dug it. It was really cool to get into uh, this particular piece, going back a little bit. But that's what I'm all about right now. Backlog mania. <laughs> so let me know your thoughts below and if you could please like, comment, subscribe and share. Check me out on Facebook and Instagram. Stay safe, till next time. Peace out peeps.